Hello, uh, good day again everyone. So uh, today we're going to be explaining uh, about E plan 2A. So again, uh, as always you can find it in your Moodle in the return tile here, E plan 2A. But uh, first and foremost, I want you to understand that before you watch this video tutorial, I want you to first uh, I hope that you have learned first the discussion and understand the discussion and uh, watch all these videos and supplements for you to understand the terms and the definitions that are going to be used in the e-plan. So again, uh, this video is only the, the second part. So first, before you proceed in watching this tutorial, you should first uh, understand what is compass error, compass heading, uh, magnetic north, magnetic error, compass north, and all. So, you can understand that by listening to the discussion and by uh, reading the supplement. So, uh, having said that, we now proceed to the E-Plan 2A. So, again, uh, all the materials is here. So, we open this E-Plan 2A. So, this is the one. So, uh, again, uh, you should print this and... Uh, uh, read all the contents carefully and uh, prepare the necessary requirements. So in here, uh, we can see that the equipment needed are the following. So almost same as the requirements in the prelim. So I trust you already have this chart number one because it was used in uh, uh, prelim. So you already have that material. So again, you should also familiarize what are the performance criteria. This is what you're going to be doing. And the uh, most important part is here, uh, the scenario description. So I will read it. At 1200, the ship's DR position was at 13 degrees 00, 00 minutes north and longitude 124 degrees 40 minutes east. On course, uh, 310 degrees. So if you have read the previous video, so you would understand the term PSC. PSC means uh, per ship's compass. So this is compass heading, so to speak. And uh, this with a speed of 15 knots. So that is the scenario. And the OW instructed the cadet, uh, which is you, to uh, determine the compass error. So if you have read the this, this in the discussion and watch the video, so you will know what is compass error. So compass error uh, is the the this together it is the result of both variation and deviation. So anyway, uh, we go to chart number one because uh, that is what uh, he needs. So I trust that you have already have the chart number one, but if not, then we will download it. So this is chart number one and position 13 degrees north and 1 to 4, 40 minutes is so 13 degrees north and 1 to 4, 14 degrees is somewhere around here. So uh, we put this in paint. So this is the situation. The ship's position is at 13 degrees north and uh, 1 to 4, 40 minutes east. So 1 to 4, 40 minutes east. So uh, this is the position 13 degrees north and 1 to 4, 40 degrees east. So, I push here. This is the DR position. And uh, it says that with a compass course of 310 degrees. So, 310 is, 310 is around here. 310. We make a 
from the compass is written so you put it here so again uh, as, as you already know you should mark all what you do in the chart as per uh, the international annotation you will put dr you will put the course and time in this illustration i will not be doing but in your uh, performance you will always mark uh, the 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 label in the chart for example here you will mark dr for example here you will mark the course and all so uh, in this situation we already performed or we already made the situation the scenario so we go to the performance criteria so selected compass rows nearest to the coordinates so obviously uh, your position is somewhere here so this is the compass rows that uh, is near so next one is determine the variation of the compass rows so if you have uh, listened to the discussion and viewed the video, so it's already uh, needless to say that uh, anyway, I will, I will review this, but uh, you already know that this is the variation on the variation on the chart. So I will make it here so it's more visible. So this is the the variation the variation this so uh next one is it says update updated the variation of the current year of the chart so uh i i hope that again you already watched the video but for quick demonstration and for explanation of the e plan i will explain it here so uh, listen carefully so in here uh, in the compass row it says that uh, the variation is 1 degrees and 15 minutes west so I trust that you follow that and then it was still but it was in 2013 so uh, current year now is 2020 so there is a difference of 7 years so it says here that uh, you can see 2 minutes here, so it means that it will increase two minutes uh, per year. So, in that in that uh, situation, uh, we multiply two times seven. Now we get uh, fourteen. So I hope you follow as a recap. Uh, this 11, one degrees fifteen minutes west is the variation at 2013. But now it's 2020. So. 2020 minus 2013 is equal 7 so therefore this error this let this mark here will be multiplied by 7 and that's how we get 14 minutes so for further explanation and a recap a uh, video tutorial is given there in the lecture content so moving on uh, this 14 minutes since it is the same name we will add it to the one degrees 15 minutes so therefore you will have a variation a variation of 15 plus 4 equals 29 so you will have a variation of one degrees 29 minutes west that is your error for 2020 so We already performed that task. You can write it, uh, your computation here. So I would uh, say that you write your computation here or you write your computation on your chart. So as long as I find the computation. Next one is determine the deviation from the given compass heading. So as a recap, uh, you can know the, comp the division by the division table. So this is the division table. And... Uh, your our compass course was our compass course was 310 so this is our uh, compass course so having said that uh, our compass course is 310 
So this is the division for the course of 310. So this is the variation and one degrees west is the deviation. And lastly, compass error. So of course, compass error is the combination of uh, variation and deviation. So that's why compass error, in this case, it is addition because uh, it is the same name. So, therefore, 1 degrees 29 minutes plus 1 degrees is equals to 2 degrees west. 2 degrees 29 minutes west. So, uh, this is our compass error. So, this uh, computation you, will write, you can write here and you replan over the chart. So, as a summary, uh, you should just plot the scenario on your chart and after that uh, you compute based on the compass rows and the deviation table the variation and the deviation and you compute for the compass error so uh, do this for e plan 2 and this will also be used for uh, your oral you perform the following and you also explain so that's it uh,